wash and the juice from yesterday didn't want to come off the car. Here, here's one spot where it's still there. Can you see that? Like it's like, <laughs> like really, oh man it's on the roof. Yeah it's definitely still staining the roof. But yeah it was, oh yeah here it's on my window right here. You can see it. Man. It's like takes a lot of elbow grease. And I just waxed my car, so it's like got fresh layer of protection, but the juice just sticks, man. It's that expensive green juice, you know? Fresh, fresh squeezed. All the investors that initially invested, an opportunity for them to get their money back. And basically screw all the, everybody else, the, you know, like the, the average investor. Like, how much you want to bet that when Uber goes public, it's going to be similar to Facebook, where all the people that bought in end up losing, you know? Remember, Facebook opened at, like, 45 or something, and then closed at, like, 25? It was, like, a bunch of people got robbed. Like, I don't know. There's just a lot of shadiness going on in the stock market these days. Like... I don't think that Uber needs to go ever go public. Well, that's kind of a trend these days, you know, people doing chicken coops. Are you serious? Yeah. I know somebody that has the, the coops made in China and sells them out here, and he's he's making a lot of money. He's Chinese. Oh, really? I know, chicken coop. Oh, I think some of it has. Wow, it's hot in here, dude. You got the Oh, yeah, I got on? the AC. Yeah, here we go. Oh, wow, cool. yeah. yeah. Heat drives me nuts. All, All right, right babe. Cool. You be a good boy. That's Here, cool. This is me, dude. You're gonna laugh, dude. That's how I looked. No way. Yeah, when I started in this business. <laughs> oh and here's wow. Here's my other one. Look, it looks like two different dudes. That's crazy. That's some serious hair. Yeah, dude. It looks like unreal. Yeah, I'm a total glam rocker guy, dude. So you can discuss music with me all day long. Picked up a firm today, dude. Another 75k a year for my company. Yeah, dude, we're the best. I'm telling you, dude. Unprecedented. You can never find any dirt on us. Keep a couple of them for you. If anybody comes in your car. Yeah, I will. If they got in a wreck, tell them to call 818 number. That's my cell phone. Okay, cool. For sure, dude. I'll hook you up big time, dude. I'll take care of it personally. I'm the one who settles everything. Oh, okay. Yeah. So I'll I get you a killer set of my... Yeah, well, the other thing I could do is back up the cards on my computer every day. But it's a that's lot a of data. Idea. Yeah, that's a good idea. But it's so much data, so I basically, I just take the clips that matter to me, right? And every day I just go over, you know, record over every day. Well, yeah, unless you need something, unless something happens, right? If something happens, then you know you got it. Yeah, that's a good idea, dude. And I have my YouTube channel. I make videos. Oh, that's awesome, dude. Yeah, I could plug your uh, your accident thing on my video. Oh, that's awesome, your, dude. Your business. <laughs> for sure, bro. Do it, man. Do it. Man. Yeah. Man. All right. Nice I'll to meet you, Dan. You. Yeah, for sure, dude. We're buddies for life, dude. Yeah. Trust me. I can't believe how close we live to each other. Okay, dude. Let me put you in a five-star right here, dude. Oh, yeah, please. Dude, I'm going to call you for sure tomorrow, dude. I need you to take me, bro. Please. No problem. Here I'll you are, that. Dave. Dave, don't be brave. Five-star. <laughs> thanks. Give you a little tip action too. Oh, dude. thanks. All right, brother. Cool. Yeah, no Got problem. You covered, bro. All right. Yeah. My man. Cool. I'll call you tomorrow. Yeah, thank You're you. Good man, dude. Have I really dinner. enjoyed our convo. Yeah, it was cool. Really good to meet you. Absolutely. You'll see me again tomorrow. <laughs> All right, brother. All right. Bye. Bye, bye. Now, you want me to close this? Auto. The tip wasn't there, but. 
do you think he may have just lied to me and said he was giving me a tip on the app and he didn't? That's ne that never happens, right? <laughs> Why is it every time somebody tells you they're going to tip you on the app? But the weird thing is he was doing it right in front of me. Do you, do you think he's going to call me tomorrow? Like, I don't even know at this point. So, I should probably, if he does, I should drive him tomorrow just so I could give him one star. That's what I'm thinking. Because it's a trip all the way to Commerce. But, like, I'm blown away. Like, the guy tells me that he's going to tip me right in front of me. And then he didn't do it. Like, what? I can't believe that guy. Maybe the snot rag in the door tells you all you need to know. <laughs> or the fact that he said, trust me. I, I checked. And no, there wasn't a tip there. I want to know from you guys. What do you think? Do you think maybe he didn't tip me? Is Uber keeping our tips? Is it possible that he did tip me? And that Uber didn't give it to me? What do you guys think? Dude, I'm, I'm miserable. I'm totally miserable. Where's T? Is she I at work? I can't for Polka. You want to hang out with me later on, Nathan? <laughs> you can just cover yourself with a towel outside before Dude, I get there. That sounds like fucking torture. <laughs> Where, oh my god, that sounds like torture. Where is... Uh, I'm just standing here in the bathroom right now, like trying to figure out my next move. I can barely move. <笑>我知道那个马熊我知道那个马熊我知道那个马熊我知道那个马熊我知道那个马熊我知道那个马熊我知道那个马熊我知道那个马熊我知道那个马熊我知道那个马熊我知道那个马熊我知道那个马熊